In this video I'm going to talk about the Colorado potato beetle and I'm going to let you know how I deal with them in my garden. There are four stages in a Colorado potato beetle's life cycle. This is the last stage, or adult. They can do a lot of damage as adults and it's not just the amount they eat of your potato leaves but they also lay eggs which turn into larvae and then eventually into adult potato beetles. The adults lay masses of orange colored eggs on the bottom side of the leaves. The eggs look very much like ladybug eggs but I squish them all just to make sure. Ladybugs and their larvae like to eat potato beetle eggs so if you see those leave them alone. Doing away with the potato beetle eggs is a very important part of breaking the life cycle. After they hatch, they are in the larva stage. While the larvae are very small, it's a great time to squish them while you wear gloves, of course. After the larvae grow large enough, it can be quite messy, so I get rid of those like I do the adults. I add some dish soap to a bucket, it can be any size of bucket, and then I add water to create suds, and you only need about two inches of water, it doesn't have to be deep, and it doesn't have to be a bucket, it can be any container that will hold a couple of inches of water. Make sure you don't leave a bucket with water in it unattended because it's dangerous to children. This is a large larva that is almost ready to pupate. The pupa stage is the third stage. I treat the pupa and adults the same way. I take them off the plant by hand and then I drop them into the soapy water. If this sounds like too much work and you think you'll just spray them, keep in mind that Colorado potato beetles are resistant to quite a few insecticides. When looking for eggs, check the underside of the leaf because that's where they lay them. Then if you want, you can squish them or pull the leaf and drop it into the soapy water with the adults and the larva. If you want to do it this way, then make sure they come in contact with the soap and water for quite a while. When I do it this way, I like to pour them out on the ground when I'm done and squish them with my foot just to make sure. I mentioned that you shouldn't disturb ladybugs or their larvae because they eat potato beetle eggs. And here's a ladybug larva eating some eggs. You probably won't see any in the third stage, which is the pupa stage, because they like to drop to the ground to finish that stage. By inspecting your potato plants every day or two and removing larvae, adults, and eggs, you can save a lot of damage to your potato plants. If you found this video to be helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and share. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.